Uh, my name is Arwa Abu Haikal. I live in Tarumeda. We are going today to visit the Abu Aisha family. And uh, in the bus we used to use our steps to go to visit them, which is, won't take two minutes to be in their house. But now we have military post, uh, so we can't go to visit them from the uh, road which we used to use. Now uh, we need to go all around the area to be possible for us to visit them and we don't know that the soldier there will allow us or to go there or not. Here there's the military post and the settlement and Abu Aisha family is very close behind the olive tree here so it's not that far at all to be in their house but we will see today how long it will take us to, to, to be there. We are just passing here the military checkpoint. Let us hope the soldiers won't notice us. Seems not. Let us keep going. Um, here there's a um, rubbish skip, which is like a point. It's not allowed for Palestinian to uh, to pass it. It's allowed just for a uh, Jewish to pass it. Even international who come to support Palestinians is not allowed for anyone to be there or to make interviews. On the right hand side, our main steps and higher up the uh, military, military uh, observation uh, point. Uh, the uh, olive trees belong, belong here to Palestinians and underneath it there is uh, an ambulance. It belongs to settlers and they use it uh, just for Jewish people and sometimes to attack Palestinians. On the left hand side, the settlement and the uh, original caravans, which they put them in 1984. Let's hope this won't notice. Oh, they noticed us. And the Maryam, uh, she started calling the um, soldiers to stop Arab from passing to the area. This is Abu Aisha house. And we are almost there. Open the door. That's in the bed. What? Oh, yeah. It's a little bit of a little bit of I'm coming to visit them. Is it not allowed? No, it is not allowed. Oh, do you? Are, are they in the jail? No, but This is my ID. Yes, but you're not part of their family. So you're not allowed to visit them here. <laughs> they are our neighbors. So? So it's not allowed for us to visit them? No, it isn't. Those are my orders. Which kind of law is this? It's the law here. So you're not here, which to... law? There it is. Can I have your ID, please, also? One second, we're here. Assalamu alaikum. Kiva Halak. Yalta Kilafi. Yeah, that's really good. <laughs> انت ممنوع الا العيله بس تزوركم بس ولا العيله في شيء ولا حاجه what she said it's even the family is not allowed for them to come and visit them here حتى محمد ممنوع تطلع محمد مين and she said her son her sister in law she can't go and come back usually they stop her for 3 or 4 hours no. Even the first step family is not allowed for them to visit. I don't know which kind of law in any world in this world can can stop families or friends from visiting each other. Maryam. Or neighbors even. Mariam. Mariam. <laughs> Good to know your neighbors. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> 
כי הם לא יכולים להביא אורחים, אבל היא לא גרה פה, והיא באה במטרה לעשות פרובוקציה. אם הם ראו את המבוא, הם שמים Look, I think we can't, we can't wait for them till they sort it out. Come in. Come in. ممكن تحكي لنا شو اسمك؟ ريما تيسي لابويش من امتى بلشت المشاكل مع المستوطنين في هاي المنطقة؟ هذه من اول انتفاضة اول انتفاضة اللي؟ اللي اخرانية الثانية الثانية uh, The troubles start uh, with them in the second intifada which is 2002 uh, طب uh, كيف بلشت؟ بلشت لما صار القصف والطح والضرب وكانوا ممنوع علينا التجول وما حدش يخش علينا من مره لهذا الان. In that time it was a really terrible situation and and shooting and bombing in all over the West Bank, not just just in Hebron. So since that time they stopped the relatives and the friends from visiting them. طب الناس اللي كيف تنقلوا اغراضكم؟ عائدي في الاكياس تحملهم عائدي طب والثلاجة؟ الثلاجة على العربية و... وانان الغاز ايام بحملهم على كتفه ما بياخذش عربية بحملهم على كتفه كيس طحين برضه على كتفه سكر كله هذا كله وحتى ايام بوقفنا الجندي تحت ممنوع نطلع اغراضنا بتنسيق ولا؟ من دون تنسيق اوكي امم Every time they want to bring anything to the house, they need to carry it or to put it in uh, on a wheel um, basket or trolley so they can carry it to here because it's not allowed for any car to, to come to the area. And uh, anything they need to buy, like gas uh, jars or uh, fridges or uh, anything the house needs. They need to carry it by hand or to carry it by to push it by trolley. So it's not it's not easy life. Ambulances. بالنسبة لسيارات الإسعاف. الإسعاف إلا بتنصيف. They should get a permission. أنا بقول لك قبل هذا الولد سجبت ولد صاب لي نزيف الساعة تنتين في الليل. قبل. She was pregnant before she got this new. A child, and uh, they uh, call the uh, ambulance, and they refuse to. رفضوا uh, يعطوك تنسيق. لا ما مش رفضوا. أنا صابني نزيف ساعة تنتين في الليل. She had bleeding at two o'clock at night, and she walked all the way to the hospital, and she lost the baby. طبعا الولد راح. الولد راح. تاني مرة حملت في هدول تون. He is one of. He is a twin. Yeah. We called the ambulance. We called the ambulance. We called the ambulance. Ah, when she reached the hospital, the other baby, she lost the other one. 